Glory to Jesus Christ. It's been a while since I posted a video. I hope to draw your attention to a brief catechesis that I wrote. Very brief catechesis. It's called A Catechesis for God Butchers. And I've posted it at my Substack at catholic460.substack.com. Also posting it at catholic460.com. And as you might have guessed, this uh, catechesis is based off of the recent character, Gore, the God Butcher, from the most recent Thor movie. And I found this character so incredibly interesting, particularly from the synopsis in the comic books back in 2013, in which he comes across much more clearly as a figure, much more like Job, um, but without the kind of training Job would have had on how to handle suffering. And so, um, it seemed really important today based on seeing the atheism that exists today and seeing the suffering that exists today to really try and address these questions as why does it seem that God doesn't hear us? Why is it that God is so hidden from us? Why can't I see God if God is really there? And so I really wanted to address in all of this uh, and acknowledge number one, that there is real suffering. It is real horrific. And in fact, we don't watch out for uh, just how easy it is to fall into questioning God. There's a little a little God butcher inside each one of us that wants to revolt, that even if we still hold on to belief in God, we, we might even, God forbid, we might even start to hate God because of the horrific suffering that is possible in this world. So we really need to address why is suffering even possible in this world, not just patting people on the head, but really taking a look at the structure of existence itself. And so briefly, after taking a look at this Gore character, after acknowledging how suffering can drive some people to atheism, I took a little look at the metaphysics of time and eternity. And so I wanted to make this really brief introductory video to the article, the article, a catechesis for God butchers, the metaphysics of time and eternity, I'm going to put it underneath this video, the address of how to get to it at the Substack, catholic460.substack.com. And I encourage, if you would, please, um, thank you for subscribing at this YouTube channel. And maybe you'll be interested in, in, in getting the emails that come out about once a month that uh, from the Substack whenever I get the chance to write these articles, particularly during my summer breaks and when I'm not having to teach in the fall and spring semester, I have breaks, I'm able to do a little bit more writing. And so anyway, take a look underneath this video as to where to find it, the links, and uh, do me a favor and subscribe to the Substack as well. God bless you. Thank you.